What's up guys, this is IK.com, thanks a lot for the visit. In this video, I want to analyze and synthesize the address or speech made by the country director. Building up to the meeting that was held, a publication was made and the population got some reviews. We don't want to dive into the nitty gritty of the publication, how it was made and what led to it. So it was getting some reviews and uh, Ken Wakama and his cohorts were accused of uh, not disposing the money that was meant for the masses. So he was called to Lagos. They went to Lagos for the meeting. Now in the meeting, you know, a lot of things transpired which we were not told. But now what we, what are, we are getting, getting to know was what was recorded for our own consumption. So we didn't know, we were not given some details of what happened to the meeting in Lagos, you know. So the voice note was the aftermath of what happened in Lagos. So he was addressing it in another meeting of what his own account of what transpired in the meeting in Lagos. So we want to use, we want to analyze the meeting as in his account of the meeting so as to, to get an idea of what happened in the meeting in Lagos. First and foremost, he started by thanking God and uh, kind of making a statement which some people were saying that is a derogatory statement because he was saying that Nigeria can endure anything. Nigeria endure anything. That Nigeria has the capacity to endure things. So some people were saying that that statement was kind of derogatory. That uh, he shouldn't have make that preface you should have just dive into the thing or say another thing you know so sort of saying nigerians can endure anything which means you can do things and get away with it that's what some people were saying then secondly he made mention of two weeks ago the evil the devil entered their midst to scatter things you know uh he didn't deny that there was quarrel he didn't deny it he accepted it wholeheartedly that they had a lot of conflicts you know had a lot of conflicts so he mentioned it that exactly two weeks ago according to what he said that the devil entered their means to scatter things you know then he came to make another statement which some people were saying that it's 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 an annoying diversion for what is on ground we are talking about a serious issue here where the masses need an answer the masses needs an answer from you and you diverted by saying that few days ago somebody called you when you were going to meeting to lagos and he was telling you uh, about the meeting in lagos and you provoke or the person say how did the person know you know you can't tell him how does he know that you're going to the meeting in lagos because it is now a household information the publication was made you were summoned so it's something that concerns that shouldn't even provoke you for you know somebody telling you are going to meet in lagos if you are saying that this meeting should be held in secret this grant issue now is not a secret something this involves more than 100 million people how can it be a secret so some people were saying that the the, the statement was kind of uh, derogatory and he made mention that there was no money there has been no money the money has been with the government now if you've been following this uh issue if you're following this disbursement saga remember let me not go too far december 27th was the date he gave he even came out to make a pronouncement that the disbursement will be made disbursement will be made on 27th of december categorically emphatically he used the word which is sacrosanct if you don't have the money then what are you disbursing that's a question that's a question some people are asking then december was crawling to an end he now made a statement that it due to holidays these things are online 
these things are him giving the voice note then that uh, uh, is because of the week uh, end and short holidays that's why the money was not disbursed december but come you january the money will be disbursed first week came second week came that was what we'll be hearing 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 that will be disbursed coming to this moment now we were hearing that there was no money or there is no money how do you expect people to react how do you expect people to respond to this this news and still hold you at a high esteem for me i think he has a lot of questions to answer you were saying that there's disbursement you were saying that there will be disbursement then coming now you are not telling us that the document has been signed which document were you talking about before that you are going to disburse with you know and January also he came out and made a statement about the app about disbursement procedure and said the disbursement is at hand that everybody should make sure he ratifies his bank account so our bank account you know so that is the critical analysis we want to give uh, now uh, some voice notes were coming that some people uh, were taking money from to to about this if you know that you you are the head of affairs you can't tell me that you don't know that there's no money if there's no money then why blowing the trumpet for people to get their banks ready you should have spit it out that at the moment we don't have money the money is with federal government but all along this was not said so t- critically analyzing all these things we don't think that uh, Ken Wakama really did a good job of his position or which means he has us he has something to to hide then Chief Okoku came on exactly last week to speak his own mind they told him a date will be announced and a date has been given to him does that mean he was scammed a date was given to him but there was no money so which money will be disbursed on the date that was given to him we are just throwing these rhetorical questions so that you use it to analyze the the the, the, the standpoint of uaag and know what is going on now the information is now a household information that this even grant to want to disburse is not gotten from uaag it was all grant pressure group that got it. They just carried Apostle Ken and Co. along to save themselves as in their shame, their, their face from shame. Then, why this behavior from somebody that they want to save yeah, his head from shame? So, critically analyzing this issue, uh, you know, we pray that this money will be disbursed because the way it's going. They are saying that the, the date is soon, but seems far-fetched, you know. So anyways, we'll keep our fingers crossed, we'll keep our fingers crossed and our ears open to listen to more updates. Then you stick to our channel because uh, latest update doesn't pass us by. When we get it, when we grab it, we decide to share it with you people. So guys, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for hosting our channel. We'll see you on our next videos, guys. Let's just pray that this grab comes. A lot of people have pumped in money. A lot of people have risked a lot. A lot of people have even died anticipating this. So let's just pray that the nearest time we'll be giving our own grant due. Thanks, guys. See you on our next videos, guys. Remain blessed. Remain calm. Peace out, guys. One love.